Hello, this is Nature Technology. Today we will make a basketball arcade using Arduino and some recycled materials. First thing to do is to build the ring and the platform and then later on I will explain the program step by step. So let's start.
Here we go, we are now in the programming part of this tutorial. All you need to do is to listen carefully because this program is kinda easy if you know what you are doing. So let's start. First, download the library for the 7th segment TM1637. Browse it through internet and then download it. Then paste it to the Arduino library. Then copy these three lines of codes. Then after, after you copy that, declare some variables for LED, push buttons and motors, LDR. Then the pins for the seven segment. Then after that, declare another variables for the LDR state, left switch state, right switch state. Then the variables for the left and right points because the dual counter is um, separated. Then the speed for the motor. Then the stage stage level. So after that, uh, set up. Copy this lack of codes. This two has a conflict. So if you need a serial begin, just uncomment this and then comment this two. There's a conflict between that. So if you are done set up those input and outputs, we can now go to the void loop. So first mm, read the value of those sensors via analog read and digital read then just like I said if you want to use the serial command just comment this too all the things that connected with the seven segment you need to comment that then uncomment the serial serial command then always turn on the LED after that we'll have a if else statement so first if stage is greater than one we will do nothing first then we will go here we will go first on the else condition so on the else condition, we will put a if another if condition. If LDR is greater than 400, then the right points will increment by one. This one is for the shooting of the ball on the ring. Um, this delay is important to avoid the glitch because if you don't put a delay, everyone should may maybe it will become a thousands or hundreds so you need a delay to avoid the glitch then we will put a another if condition if right points is equal to 5 then stage is increment by 1 delay by 10 so we will go now to the if statement if the stage is greater than 1 we will put a while condition everything you declare outside outside this while loop will ignore by the while loop condition so you need to declare it again the, the readings and display of the dual counter so next for the motor the meaning of motor cc is counterclockwise so it will go to the left and the mot motor for clockwise is zero so it's turn off then we will put another if condition here just like what I said everything outside the while loop will be ignored so we will declare it again so if LDR is greater than 400 so if you shoot the ball then it's the LDR and it is greater than 400 then right points must be increment so delay by 300 again then next this is the break point of this while condition so 
if left switch is equal to 1, the motor will become 0, delay by 100 and brake. By the way, we have the left switch and the right switch, left switch and the right switch because the the DVD DVD reader has a DC motor and tap on it it has a recombination on there it will sway left side and right side vice versa so let's continue then after this we will make another while loop so the vice versa of this while loop just change just copy this then change something like the motor C we will use we will use here the motor C so clockwise the rotation of the motor will be will become clockwise then same condition we shoot then hits the LDR and greater than 400 plus points delay by 300 then if the right switch is equal to 1 then the loop was break then go here so until it is not break the loop was here it will not go down so you need to you need to hit the left switch first before you go down then go to this loop so it will not go up until it hits the right switch so let's upload it and see what happens here it is now after uploading every shoot that counted is plus one to your points then if you shoot five times the ring will move sideways so that's it thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe